Welcome to our lesson on finding the volume of a cube and a cuboid. To work out the volume of a cuboid, we need to find the area of a cross section, which could be in this face here, and we multiply the area of a cross section by the depth. And you can see that a cuboid has three possible cross sections. There is one here, where the depth is in this direction, there's one at the top, where the depth is in the vertical direction and there's a cross section here where the depth is going backwards. So to work out the volume I'm going to choose this cross section here. And the area of this, well this is a rectangle and we can say that each cube is one centimeter so this would be two centimeters by three centimeters. So the area of this cross section is two times three which is six centimeters squared and the depth is here, which is 4 centimetres. So you multiply the area of a cross section by the depth. 6 times 4 is 24. And centimetre squared times centimetre is centimetres cubed. And this makes sense because you can see we have 6 here and another 6 behind it. And again and again. So we've got 4 lots of 6 centimetres cubed. And the question B, I'm going to choose out the top face as the cross section. And the area of this top face is 6 centimetres, which is this length, multiplied by the width, which is 3 centimetres, this length here. So the area of the top face is 6 times 3, which is 18 centimetres squared, multiplied by the depth, which is going in this direction, two centimeters. So a volume is 18 times two, which is 36. Centimeter squared times centimeter, centimeters cubed. Okay, let's move on to some more questions. So do you want to try and work out the volumes of a cuboid in question C and D? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So for question C, I'm going to choose this face here as the cross section which is seven centimeters by two centimeters so the area of the cross section is 14 centimeters squared and i'm going to multiply it by this depth which is four centimeters and 14 times four is 56 centimeters cubed and for question d i'm going to use the front face as a cross section which is 8 by 2, so 16 centimetres squared, multiplied by the depth of 4 centimetres, which is 64 centimetres cubed. Okay, let's try one more question. So do you want to try and work out the volume of this hollow frame, where we have a bigger cuboid with a smaller cuboid taken from it. You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So we're going to begin by working out the area of this cross section here. And we can work this out by using a bigger rectangle, which is this rectangle here, taking away the smaller rectangle, which is this one here. So you know the bigger rectangle? has a length of 12 and a width of 8 and the smaller rectangle has a width of 5 and 2 so we've got 96 centimeters squared take away with 10 centimeters squared so the area of a cross section is 86 centimeters squared and we're going to multiply this by the depth which is 5 centimeters so this gives you a volume of 430 centimeters cubed Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care